If you believe the pissy YouTubers who forgot what it's like to be honest with themselves, then Din Djarin is about to die in the season three finale of The Mandalorian. Hey everyone, if you thanks for joining the channel, please give us a like and a subscribe and help me with the algorithms. Uh, but if you subscribe, we have videos coming all the time and they're pretty honest videos. So enjoy those. Don't forget to hit the bell. Okay, all that stuff is out of the way. Look, is Din Djarin going to die i made that joke about the pissy youtubers but that might not be the case there could be actual evidence that suggests that din Djarin is going to perish in the season three finale of the mandalorian so let's look at why there are reports circulating around from all unknown sources the unknown region sources that din Djarin will face off against the praetorian guards the same praetorian guards who took down heavy you know who else took down heavy din Djarin, our mandalorian hero my feeling is this is going to play out because it was built up in the last episode in episode 7 with Paz Vizsla being taken out by the Praetorian Guard. Din Djarin has been taken captive. I, one can only suspect that there will be another confrontation with Din and the Praetorian Guards. This will be kind of like that payback confrontation. So I think there will be a moment where you're like, oh man, Din's dead. He's dead meat. But he will actually prevail. Whether it all be because of him, uh, maybe Bo-Katan, maybe the armor, maybe somebody, Boba Fett, Boba Fett's not going to be in it. Somebody comes in and saves the day. That could be the Case, but I think he will succeed in this battle with the Praetorian Guards. Brennan Wayne did say he gets some kind of cool new weapon. Hopefully he like just like kills a Praetorian Guard and then next season. Imagine Din with a Praetorian Guard weapon in the following season. That would kick so much ass. The other thing I gotta say is I really feel like this season is gonna wrap up. Um, not wrap up. I shouldn't say wrap up, but this is gonna be a happy episode, a happy, pleasant ending. There will be some darkness looming around. It won't be a hundred percent you know, yay, it won't be Return of the Jedi necessarily, but it'll be closer to Return of the Jedi than Empire Strikes Back, because we just had our Empire Strikes Back, and I also believe, like, the Ahsoka series is going to be our Empire Strikes Back as well. We're going to build into Ahsoka, and Ahsoka is going to end on a dark, dismal note, because we heard Lars Mikkelsen say, you won't know Thrawn's plan until the very end of that season, and if that's the case, then you know you're in some deep doo-doo when we get there. So I believe this season, to, to get to that, to earn that, this season of Mandalorian, because because it's all one universe it's different shows but it's all one universe because we need that to get to there we're gonna have a smile on our face again there'll be some sad stuff but we'll have a smile on our face for the most part and then we'll get to it so din i don't think he's gonna die and I, I i don't know if he's necessarily gonna be the hero of it all but i think he will succeed against those praetorian guards he will live to see another day he might not be reunited with the mandos he might not be reunited with the other mandalorians but he will live to see another day mandalorian season four don't know when it's coming. Book of Boba Fett Season 2 on its way. What store? Video soon. Thanks everybody for watching. Give us a like and a subscribe. But until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.